welcome to my channel. My name is Victoria and I'm currently losing weight using Octavia. I am very excited to share this video with you today. It's on alternative fuelings and I have done several on alternative fuelings, but what makes this one different is that the fuelings that I'm going to share with you are very quick and easy to put together and they also meet the fueling parameters that Optavia has set forth. And so if I have a day that I do not want to track, then I can feel very confident that with these fuelings, I am meeting all the requirements and I can remain in fat burn. Now, the one thing that these fuelings don't have in common with the Optavia is that they don't have all the vitamins or probiotics that the Optavia fuelings provide. So I do make sure every day to take a vitamin supplement and a probiotic. I have made this in the form of a slideshow, so I will make those slides available to you below this video so that you can take a look at them if you would like to. Having said that, let's go ahead and get started with the slideshow. Quick and easy alternative feelings. The first one I'm showing you happens to also be my favorite one out of all of them. It's a spinach egg white frittata and one and a third ounces of turkey breast. The Optavia fueling parameters are 110 calories, 15 grams of carbs or less, 10 to 15 grams of protein, five grams of fat or less. I will not go over the Optavia fueling parameters for all of them. I will, from here on out, only share the alternative fueling parameters. So for the one spinach frittata and the one and third ounces of turkey breast, it came out to 110 calories six grams of carbs, 13 grams of protein, and five grams of fat. You can purchase the spinach egg frittatas at Costco, or you can go on their website at www.veggiesmadegreat.com and find a location in your area where they sell them. The pepper turkey breast I purchased at the Walmart Deli. Next up is a Jack Link and Bell Peppers. For one Jack Link, and one cup of bell peppers. It came out to 109 calories, 10 grams of carbs, 12 grams of protein, and two grams of fat. The bell peppers I purchased at the store already pre-cut. The Jack Links can be purchased at www.jacklinks.com. You can find them at Walmart, Target, and even Amazon. The pre-cut bell peppers I purchased at our local Smith's grocery store. Next up is the Too Good Yogurt and Jicama. So for one yogurt and 2.8 ounces of jicama, it came out to 110 calories, 10 grams of carbs, 13 grams of protein, and two grams of fat. The Too Good Yogurt can be found at Walmart or Target. I purchased pre-cut jicama at our local Smith's grocery store. It does cost a little bit more to get the pre-cut vegetables, but it sure saves on time and makes it quick and easy. Next, we have the hard, a hard boiled egg and cottage cheese. So for one third cup of fat-free cottage cheese and one hard boiled egg, it came out to 107 calories, four grams of carbs, 13 grams of protein, and four grams of fat. The hard boiled eggs, can be purchased at Walmart and Costco. They're already done for you. Again, it's a little bit more expensive than if you were to do it yourself, but this is all about being quick and easy. The fat-free or low-fat cottage cheese you can get at Walmart, Trader Joe's, and most grocery stores. Lastly is lemon pepper chicken and Melba toast. So for one pouch of lemon pepper chicken and one and three-fourths pieces of Melba toast, it came out to 111 calories, nine grams of carbs, 13 grams of protein, and two grams of fat. I purchased the Melba toast at Walmart, as well as the lemon pepper chicken. I hope all of you have a wonderful day, and until next time.